welcome to the Vedic Lunar Scope. Today is the 2nd of December, 2015. The moon today is in the early portions of the sign of Virgo and will be transiting its way over the course of the day through the nakshatra of Purva Palguni. Occasionally we can find ourselves in these positions where we have invested a great deal of energy, perhaps even uh, time, um, taking a lot of actions in order to bring about a particular result. We have investment in things working out in a very specific manner. Then when we begin to get the idea that things may not turn out in quite the manner that we were um, hoping for them to, well, even though we know what we might need to do next, we don't really feel quite so much like we want to do that. So we kind of get in these spaces of feeling, you know, lazy or uh, perhaps wallowing in our own misery. But what is that really going to serve? Is it going to serve anything? Well, it might initially in terms of helping you to get your feelings out, you know, but once you've processed those feelings, to still kind of sit with those feelings um, ad infinitum isn't going to help you, especially when you know what you need to do next. And it's really just the matter of doing what you need to do next. The thing is, is were you to continue to try to push your agenda in a particular manner, you'd only find yourself in a position where you were continually coming up with feelings of frustration. And those feelings of frustration would be likely greater than the sense of uh, reluctance or indolence that you now feel um, in terms of taking the actions which um, must now be taken. So the best thing that you can do at the moment is to rise above those particular feelings. Take the steps that you know are going to have to be taken. Um, it's like if you take those particular steps, the dread that you're feeling at taking those steps is actually going to lift off your shoulders. And then you'll actually find that you're doing the right thing. You'll be thankful that you made the sacrifice and things will begin to move in a much more positive direction. It's like medicine at first. Medicine doesn't always, you know, taste very good, right? Um, but when we associate it with the feelings of feeling better when uh, something has been wrong with us, then actually medicine takes on quite a positive association. And the positive um, medicine that you can really take today that's going to help you with your particular situation is to take the steps which you now know need to be taken, but which you're perhaps feeling uh, reluctant to take. Porvapal Guni is associated with um, Venus, and it's also a comma-driven nakshatra. And it's very much influenced by the uh, position of Venus. And with Venus in the tail portion of the sign of Libra, its strength is um, somewhat waning a bit. So due to that particular fact, it's um, creating feelings of not necessarily laziness, but wanting to really um, over-sensualize with one's feelings. When instead, uh, there's the need to uh, do what is the right thing to do, to work better in uh, harmony with yourself rather than against yourself. Because Porva Palguni is ultimately associated with the divine contract, with those things that you know you need to do, uh, cooperating with yourself in order to fulfill your destiny. Those are all the things that Porva Palguni relates to. It's Krishna Saptami today, which is the seventh day of the dark half of the moon. Uh, it's the same lunar tithi as yesterday, and sometimes we have that particular um, phenomenon happen. And with this, again, it's the idea of um, befriending the situation that you're dealing with, cooperating with the forces that are there, exercising a degree of self-control, being able to see things with perspective and actually doing the right thing because you do it. The solar lunar yoga today is Vishkamba. Vishkamba is about finding support through doing the right thing. The universe can't help us out when we're not doing the things which ultimately are beneficial to our path. Now, ultimately, that's all in the you know, great game plan, too, making those mistakes and not getting that report, because that's that support, rather, because that's something that um, helps us to grow and helps us to evolve so that we then know uh, what to do right the next time around. 
So if you want that support, if you want things to begin to flow uh, more in your favor, then you need to cooperate now with the steps that you know you now need to take. Just a reminder, you can visit my website if you wish and schedule an astrological service, uh, www.authenticastrology.com. Also, while you're there, please check out the Nakshantra video course done with fellow astrologer Ryan Korzak. That's going to do it for your Vedic Lunar Scope for today, the 2nd of December, 2015. Until next time, please take the very best care of yourself. Bye now. 